As Alcohol Awareness Month comes to a close, we speak with one person who shares his interesting journey with this disease. Here's more. Two trips to a psychiatric facility after a near suicide attempt, three failed marriages all uh, collapsing uh, around me trying to hide my drug and alcohol use. There are many contributing factors as to why people abuse alcohol. For Cuban, his issues stemmed from childhood. Uh, when I began drinking to excess, it was really to mute my feelings about myself. Uh, I was a heavy kid. I was bullied pretty severely. I was even physically assaulted uh, over my weight. Cuban says there's a difference between cause and correlation, and he doesn't blame anyone for his addiction. He says in 2007, his then-girlfriend drove him to a psychiatric hospital after he had a blackout. Standing in that parking lot, a few things occurred to me. One, there wouldn't be a third trip back to that facility. I'd be dead. Two, she was going to leave me. Cuban says he also thought about his father expressing the importance of family. Centers for Disease Control says alcohol abuse produces a chemical called alcetaldehyde that damages your DNA beyond repair. When DNA is damaged, a cell can begin growing out of control, creating a cancer tumor. Cuban has 14 years sobriety and says it's important to find your compassionate community to help you through the process. Cuban says there are many paths to recovery and for him it's abstinence.